Okay, so moving on to question number 10. How would you distinguish between the first, second, and third ionization energies of an atom? So first, I'm just going to write down the definition of ionization energy. So ionization energy is the energy required to remove one electron from a neutral atom. So with some elements, after you remove one electron, it's possible to remove a second one and a third one. However, the more, the more amount of times you remove an electron from a certain atom, the harder it gets to remove an additional one. So that means it requires more energy if you wanted to remove an electron a second time than it is to remove an electron the first time. So the first time you remove an electron, the ionization energy I'll denote as IE1. If you want to remove a second electron, it's called ionization energy 2. And I also wrote that this energy would be greater then ionization energy 1. But the ionization energy, if you wanted to remove a third electron from the atom, would be much greater than the other two, since it just gets harder and harder to remove more electrons from an atom. So let's see what our junior tutor said. The first ionization energy is the energy required to remove one electron from a neutral atom. When a cation forms after its first ionization undergoes a second ionization, it loses another electron. The energy required for this process is the second ionization energy. Now when the cation from the second ionization undergoes a third ionization, using the third ionization energy, it loses another electron with a final charge of 3 plus. Take note that the second ionization energy is higher than the first, the third is higher than the second, and the first, and so forth. This is because the electrons to be removed are becoming nearer to the nucleus, which requires greater energy. Okay, so this solution is correct. Thank <laughs> you.